Hey guys, welcome back to more My Hero Academia reaction. So, this episode, Bakugo versus Ochako. Mm -hmm. uh, my money's on Bakugo because, mm -hmm. you know, he's one of those characters that the show has been building up since day yeah. one. Yeah. And there's no way he's going to be eliminated here because as much as we love Ochako, I just, Bakugo is a much bigger character. Than yeah, that. not even that. I just can't see her... I just can't see her finding that like lucky strike to be able to knock yeah. him out or yeah. overpower him yeah. in some way. Like as much as I love the character and as much as I love her and seeing her story, I just yeah, like you said, like Bakugo is on some other level. Yeah, and Bakugo, Todoroki and Deku are the main stars of the show. Mm -hmm. So, you mm -hmm. know, there's For no sure. way they're gonna have him lose and this count early. him out just yet exactly i feel like if he were to lose it would definitely be against like either Todoroki, Todoroki or, or Deku. Deku has to be yeah so with that being said let's get on with my hero guess i'll see you in the finals that's cute i know she's like shaking and shit she's nervous hell i'd be too yeah look who the hell she's up against look at that game face yo look at this <laughs> A fucking game I'd face. be nervous too if I was up against a fiery angry monster. Can she technically just touch him and he's like out of bounds? Like you said! I don't, I don't see that yeah, happening. I don't see her. Because he knows her quirk. Yeah. That's what gives the disadvantage. She's got a dodge. Mm. You're not getting close to him. There's no way you can me. Oh, she took off her jacket. Whoa! She flew her jacket. No! Damn, dude. Come on. He gives zero fucks. At least the smoke is kind of giving her coverage. Yeah. Which is funny because he's the one creating the smoke. Ooh. Damn, dude. She's relentless. Nice. I'll give her that. Listen, kid, you really want to be a hero? Then stop acting like a bully. If oh, shit. Really the crowd's sense. against him. The this is not I know. This is not good for his hero credibility. Not good for public opinion, no. Are you a pro? Huh? huh? Because if you're being serious, you can go home and hang up your cape. Oh. I'd suggest looking into another career. Oh, oh. shit. You know Bakugo's fierceness is an acknowledgement of his opponent's strength. He knows she deserves to have made it this far. Mm. He's not just tossing her aside. That's good to know. That he actually takes her seriously. For keeping your eyes focused on me. Shout out to Aizawa for right. calling out that guy. Oh! Oh, shit! Nice! It's gonna be raining on Bakugo. Can he dodge this now? A meteor shower! Now you notice. Now you notice. Is he just gonna blast it? That's still not enough, I feel like. This looks good for her. No it matter, does, yeah. No matter the outcome, win or lose, this definitely looks good for her. I'm very body. impressed. Oh shit, he just blasted everything. God damn. He just blew he everything just sent away. everything to outer space. He blasted a Marco Rebecca's finishing move and remains untouched. Yeah. That's Bakugo. Uh-oh. Ooh. What happened to his hand? He wouldn't give up yet. What? What is she, what? Oh, she's gonna knock out. She's tired. There you go. Bakugo's the winner. Mm -hmm. She's tired. That took a lot of strength out of her. Uraraka is KO'd. Bakugo mm -hmm. advances to the second round. Props to her though. Yeah, the episode still made her look good. Mm -hmm. 
she doesn't have like that weak moment that like most girls in shonen animes have mm -hmm. she still had that drive oh yeah i guess bakugo is moving on you're supposed to be unbiased <laughs> <laughs> i know right that stupid desperate plan of hers you would come up with something that annoying if we end you're up wrong that wasn't his plan. plan if that battle was harder than you thought it would be and it's because of her strategy not mm -hmm. mine she gets all the credit She's fine. Recovery girl healed her. Now I realize how much more training I have to do. Huh? Are you sure you're good? <laughs> Is she putting on an act? Better than I expected. Like deep down, she's like hurting. Even if you've lost. All oh, these guys oh. again. They're Seriously? gonna be there all day. Of course, it's an arm wrestling match. Uh oh. 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 oh what? Oh. What do you want? One a. Hey man, you put up a good fight. <laughs> what the fuck is wrong with you? I know, right? But I wish I could have gone further in the festival. So it, it still had made her look good in the end. Up. I feel like that's kind of more of the point of the festival. What are you in such a hurry for, huh? I want to help you guys out Ooh. as soon as I can. She's such a good daughter. Yeah. See, she was hurting. She was just hiding yeah. it from him. He saw through it. Mm -hmm. Why are you crying, you baby? He always cries. If she's the one encouraging me again. Ah, he needs to this, stop. This episode he making me want to cry. Uh oh, uh -oh. endeavor again. Your power is pretty impressive. To create so much wind pressure just by flicking your fingers, you seem to have much in common with all. Yeah, oh, of course. His son like noticed father, the like same. Son, huh? So hit him hard. Don't disgrace yourself or him by holding back. Oh. That's all I wanted to say. I apologize for bothering you. He hey, just, I like his message. He just wants um Toroki to use the fire. What? First match is gonna be epic! Take the guy who won his last fight by the last Oh my god, probably yeah. Cause this fight deserves a full episode. These two what? could prove to be formidable obstacles to you one day. Oh, this guy again. Uh, he looks old as fuck. Which one of these levels will advance to the next Why is their fight so early? I know, this is this fight is like a finals fight. Damn. Yeah. Damn, that's a I mean, like I said, right? In the end, it didn't make her look bad. In yeah. the end, yeah. It's still like, she was still kind of like a crowd favorite. I think we've already said that before too, that Bakugo's gonna win, mm -hmm. but not without making um, Ochako look... Like a formidable yeah. opponent, yeah. 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 Cause like, that's just kind of the style of this creator. Uh huh. Kind of like, not counting out the underdogs just yet. Yeah, and it may be shonen, but they still like, you know, give thought to um, giving their female characters like stories. Mm -hmm. They still put put some thought into it. More so than other shonen animes. Because these girls, like, they didn't take the time to like have their like weak moments. Like in she other got a, shows. She got a better fight than Momo. Yeah. <laughs> Poor Momo, dude. She just got pushed out. I know. <laughs> Like, but I'm glad like they did this for um, Ochako. Mm -hmm. That meteor shower of cement looked yeah, that really was, cool. That was really impressive. Yeah. I really got a hand it to her. Like I yeah. said, like whether or not she won or lost, this this uh, battle did not make her look bad. Mm -hmm. It made her look like an actual real opponent that you should take seriously. Yeah. Like she's not some damsel in distress. She's not mm -hmm. some weak, fragile. What's the word that they called her? Frail? Frail. frail. She's not yeah. frail. Mm -hmm. She's definitely strong and she definitely has, you know, some mm -hmm. kind of strategy in mind going into this. Yeah. Sure. And she did it all, all on her own yeah. without relying on Deku. And like for for Bakugo to think that this is Deku's plan, yeah. I say that that's also impressive. Mm -hmm. Cause, you know, obviously he knows Deku as the strategist between yeah. all of them. 
and he thinks that he helped her out with that mm -hmm. but for um or Chaco to come up with this on her own yeah and to think it was Deku's for Bakugo to think like that yeah like that's definitely mm -hmm. another reason why like this fight was amazing and I don't know if if that was Bakugo shaking but after he destroyed the meteor cement shower like his hand was kind of shaking it was so I don't know if that so, was like holy shit you know that was a close one like mm -hmm. that actually happened mm -hmm. it's like you're expecting this level to be easy but then it, it hits you like ass. a truck yeah yeah this episode like pulled some heartstrings too because oh of, yeah like ochako's you know her reasoning behind all this mm -hmm. it's very relatable you're just trying to help your parents out yeah. you know like yeah. trying to support them as much as you can mm -hmm. like to give back what they what did for you what they've done for you your whole yeah. life and it really it really kind of tugs on your heart yeah and it it's it sucks because you know like she lost and then mm -hmm. but like like i said like they were saying in this episode just because you lost doesn't mean count you out just yet you could still become a pro hero and not win this tournament because i'm sure there's other pro heroes out there that like you know didn't make it so far in the tournament and they're still pros but yeah. you know it's just like she could still achieve her dream of becoming pro and helping her family out and helping her parents out send them on vacation and all that stuff mm -hmm. like i still think that that's obtainable for her like that dream isn't over just yet so next episode is what i feel like should be the fucking finals i feel like honestly if i were to look at it i Deku think versus todoroki i think the finals is gonna be bakugo and todoroki, and todoroki. you think deku is gonna lose this early i mean like the I, main I know. character i want to i, I don't know man. i want to hope I i'm wrong honestly don't know i really want to hope i'm wrong because for Todoroki to be out so early too you were mentioning know. this earlier while we were waiting for the preview mm. what was your reasoning behind just just considering like this episode was was like um like like i said with um orchako orchako like, losing like orchako losing doesn't mean she's out doesn't like mean doesn't mean over. that it's over like deku losing possibly right doesn't mean that it's over for him like he he still ended up being the number one hero despite losing despite here. losing here and it's his first year there That's are another true. couple more there's what oh, three shit. years of high yeah, school yeah, right yeah. So it could still mean that That's he true. just has more room to grow. In like, my head, this is like... This is it, this right? Is it. <laughs> yeah, you either make it or you don't. But they're still but, they're yeah, freshmen. Yeah, it's freshmen, I forgot. Yeah. They're still freshmen and normal high schools have four years. Yeah. So there's still okay. another three years for him. And considering also that one for all isn't 100%. He yeah. can't control it. He's, uh, he's breaking bones, breaking you know everything in his body for this quirk mm -hmm. and he hasn't been able to control it to master it in any way yet so for him to go against somebody that's had this much like powerful ability and has been able to control this it much hype yeah for well um Todoroki is also kind of handicapped like I said before because he's true. only using half of his power yeah if he if he's using all of it like he would be like OP as fuck like mm -hmm. this there wouldn't be any competition I feel mm -hmm. like you know and I can see that I can honestly understand that but considering even being handicapped I feel like I, I, don't, I don't know maybe Deku is gonna find a way to make Todoroki use the fire in him yeah. make this make this fight like secure Todoroki's position Mm, maybe and considering Todoroki doesn't want to use that it just yeah. shows that he needs more more practice more training yeah. with his ice because he doesn't want to rely on the fire right yeah that's the whole point of showing up to his dad is is like he doesn't want to use that side he doesn't want to use his dad's power so by using him by uh Deku kind of forcing that out of him because he knows that by forcing that out of him it just shows that Todoroki needs like I said more more training on that ice so you think by Todoroki winning means that he needed he needs to rely on his firepower mm -hmm. so that's kind of still a loss to him because mm -hmm. he used it but mm -hmm. he still but because he, of that he won he won 
Okay, I like your theories. They make sense. <laughs> they make sense. I'm I, I'm on board now. Compared to when you were talking earlier during the the and, preview the pre, before the preview, because during the preview you just said that like, oh, you know, losing doesn't mean it's over. Well, yeah. that can be said for but Shinso too. He lost, and, right? Yeah. But that doesn't mean it's over. Mm -hmm. But then you backed it up with this is it's their first year. They're still mm -hmm. second, third, right? Fourth year. And, yeah, and then there's still the fire thing. I was mm -hmm. like, okay, that makes sense. So this is all like just coming to yeah, my head. You yeah. know, it's all just like random thinking. And, yeah. And like basing, I'm gonna go with that theory. Basing it off of like other shows that we've watched, kind of the way that kind of the formula some shonen has. Yeah. And it, you know, it's a lesson for both of them in the end. Yeah. I feel like it would I feel like if if the creator has one thing in mind, it's definitely to give both of them uh, something to think about something to yeah. to keep them going so the final is gonna be Bakugo and Todoroki mm -hmm. and then Todoroki is gonna win yeah <laughs> ah, I mean I like that but I, I don't know about that I can't I don't have anything to back that up <laughs> I, I, yeah I like that but as much as I like that I also like the idea of Deku and Bakugo in the finals. Yeah. And then Deku destroying Bakugo. Mm -hmm. I don't know, dude. This With this show, it's like, who you, knows? You just don't know. Who knows? You just don't know. We just have to wait and see. Yeah, but I like your original theory. Mm -hmm. Anyways, what did you guys think of this episode? Let us know your thoughts in the comments down below. I'm Danny. I'm Ray. And we'll see you guys in the next video.